What is up all you gorgeous people? Welcome back. Hope you had a great safe weekend. An amazing thing we discovered this past weekend and something that Halo Infinite has not released yet, but maybe he's planning to and some people thinking, will it save the game? Will it not? That's up for further debate is a Halo Battle Royale is slowly being made, not by 343 and Halo, but by a Forge creator out there who has spent the last 11 months preparing a mode for all of us to enjoy the coveted Halo Battle Royale. I want to prep you guys all by saying I've talked with one of the creators of this. It's a work in progress where they are taking community feedback very seriously before you know actually pushing this public but they've been working a long time on this and, and that's a halo battle royale something that's really cool to see so here's a quick preview like other brs the flight path is always random but unlike other brs players actually roam around inside the ship as it moves i made a window on the floor for this very reason so players who choose to ride out the flight can watch where others go and plan where they want to land with the obvious trade-off here being they're the last ones to loot when you decide to jump out you can glide by simply zooming in this is one of the new mechanics added since my videos last year and with it you have full control over where you land my favorite way to use it is to feather the glide by mixing in some free falling so you get to the ground quickly Once you're on the ground, you'll want to loot these wooden crates for weapons, armor, and healing items. Armor is pretty much the same as a prototype from last year, but we've changed the pickup behavior from an interactable switch to simply walking over it. The asset itself has changed as well, but the values are still the same. Green is common and gives 0.5 bonus shields, purple is rare and grants a 1x bonus, and orange is legendary, giving you a 1.5x bonus. It was really hard. I had to do it in like 4 or 5 sections, because doing the whole map, it was just, you could not place it. Yeah, it looks nice. Thank you, and oh. it, it's good Why that it looks adding nice any, in comparison. Uh, oh, for sure. This So this is actually... This is the complete basic version you'll ever experience because I'm working on the official map, um, and I'm starting to live stream it. So um, the official map is going to be way better than this, and it's going to have trees and buildings and everything like that. Forerunner structures. Or I hope to have. I hope that it will have all of those things. Is it going to oh have a God. sandwich? Thank you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Road don't start. And the creators and owners of this go by the name of Clen, who is actually a Forge creator, and the way, and also the streamer known as Schisma, who have been talking to most about this entire project. And I'm going to link below for you guys. You can kind of go find it out as well. Schisma on Twitter, where he gives us more details both on stream and in his YouTube progress update videos about exactly what this Halo Battle Royale is actually meant to be. And he's also been doing playtests. If you guys follow me on Twitter, I talked about it this past week. He was doing several playtests this past weekend. We'll probably be doing more in the future too, where he takes the feedback back all of the bugs detected all of the issues detected by the community well he actually takes that and tries to fix the game itself as you actually heard him say they can't do drop pods it there are limited features when it comes to being a forge maker versus you know an entire dev team making a battle royale there are certainly limitations behind this thing but the passion to actually make this project for all the halo lovers and the people who wanted a battle royale like you gotta, you gotta give it credit. This is amazing. But from the drop ship, which actually is randomized each and every game, it flies across the whole map. Even the map is a demo, so it's not gonna be the same as the map upon release. Also the glide feature, you zoom in or you aim your weapon to, to glide you down. You unzoom to then to fastly go down. There's also scaling uh, shields in the game. There's heals in the game. I believe your shields also slowly recharge or you can technically shield swap, kind of a, a call to Apex Legends. There's different loot crates around the map. Of course, it eventually comes down to the BR and the sniper and, and the rocket launcher becoming you know some of your predominant weapons but there's a lot going on and this is the fact that he has spent almost a year making this I can't help but give it a shout out and it's it's got a long way to go but it is the closest thing to a Halo Battle Royale that we've, we've actually seen to date so if you guys want to check this out I would try my best to remember to link his Twitter below his discord below and his YouTube videos below if you guys actually want to partake in a play test he will take anyone in he'll take all of your feedback and there have already been I think 50 to 100 members who have signed up for his discord and a bunch that were DMing him trying to play ever since we first posted and I, I gotta throw some support his way because it, it looks fun and one day I'm definitely gonna play so what what do you guys think about a Halo Battle Royale? Will we ever see an official one? Well, I don't know. But until then, we're going to see some creator-made ones, which are still going to be fun too. Till next time, take care of yourselves. we got some great news coming. Our DMs are always open. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subbing. We'll see you back here sometime soon. Take care.